together every day, having adventures as we play. Up in the hills, down on the beach, always a rainbow within reach. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, yeah. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, come on. Hello. to say hello 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 let's stop to say hello it's a way to say we're glad you're here come on and say hello hello hedgehog hello fox hello pig hello monkey when friends are near we smile and say hello when friends are far we wave and say hello it's a friendly word that shows we care come on and say hello hello mr frog hello hello, hello mr. mr goose hello hello friend Hello. Hello. Hi. Nice to see you. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I spy shapes everywhere. Circles, triangles, oval squares, stars, rectangles, so many kinds. See how many we can find. Hello, friend. It's so good to see you. You're just in time. I was about to check the mail. I'm expecting a letter from Ms. Panda. Let's check the mail together. Are you coming? Look, there's a letter in our mailbox. It's addressed to Mr. Goose, the Treehouse, Animal Island. That means it's for me. Could it be from Ms. Panda? It is from Ms. Panda. I'll open it. There is a letter and some pictures inside. I'll read the letter out loud. Hello, everyone. I'm visiting my friend. Everywhere I go, I see shapes. I've sent you some photos. Ooh, let's look. What shape do you see in the first picture? Hmm. Do you see it? Circle! Well done! What shape do you see in the second picture? Oh, I think I see it. Circle! Fantastic! What shape do you see in the last picture? Hmm. What shape do you see? Circle! Yes! Can you find shapes on Animal Island? Love, Ms. Panda. That's a great idea. We'll make circle our special shape of the day. Let's look for circles on Animal Island. Let's look for shapes around my pond. Let's look for circles, like this. Do you see one? Yes! Let's look for another one. I see one. Let's look for one more. There it is! Well done! Let's look for more. Yes! Splendid! Let's look for one more. There it is! That was lovely! Thanks for visiting! Goodbye! Hi, Ms. Panda! What are you doing? Hi, Monkey! I cut out all of these colored shapes, and now I'm sorting them. Can I help? 
I would love it if you helped. Thank you, monkey. First, find all the purple triangles and put them in a box. Okay. Hmm. There's one. There's another one. This is purple. That's a square. We only want purple triangles. Oh, right. I forgot. There's one. Thank you, monkey. Now, let's gather all of the purple stars. Okay. Here. Here. And here. Splendid! Should I look for purple squares now, Ms. Panda? That's a good idea! Okay! Here, 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 and here! Great! And what's left? Two red shapes! Okay, let's put both of them in their own box. Okie dokie! No more shapes! Thank you so much, monkey! What are all of these shapes for? Whatever we want! We can use them to make art projects! Ooh, I could use two triangles to make a bow tie! Look! <laughs> Oh, monkey, you look very fancy. Let's look for circles. Do you see one? Let's look for another one. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is! We did it! <laughs> Yay! See you! It's story time! Yay! Gather round, everyone! What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called The Great Cleanup. In this story, Keisha and Mizamo decide to surprise their parents by cleaning up. Let's read it. Let's begin. The Great Cleanup. Written by Corinne Lamoro Rosmarin. Illustrated by Jess Jardim Wiedepole. Designed by Ashlyn Atkinson. We are going to have so much fun while Grandfather is having a nap, says Big Sister Keisha. Oh, yes, says little brother Mizamo. What will we do? We will clean the house for Papa and Mama while they are out. That's no fun, says Mizamo. Uh-uh, no, not me. I don't want to clean up. But Papa and Mama will be so proud. Let me show you how much fun we will have, says Keisha. First, we will put the toys away. Now, we will sweep the porch. Now, we will wash the dishes. Now, we will wash the windows. Now, we will polish the floor. Now, we will wash the clothes. Now we will hang up the clothes. Surprise! I have been watching them the whole time, and they have been little angels, says Grandfather. The End Thank you, Mr. Goose! Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! 
Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids! Hello, Mr. Frog! I'm going to teach you a song called hush a -bye Baby. And look what I have in my backpack. An electric bass. I'll sing the song first, then you sing along with me. Okay, let's begin. hush a -bye Baby on the treetop when the wind blows, the cradle will rock. When the bow breaks, the cradle will fall. And down will come, baby, cradle and all. Now this time, we'll all sing together, OK? OK. Yeah. Yes. I'm ready. Here we go. Hush-a-bye, baby, on the treetop When the wind blows, the cradle will rock When the bow breaks, the cradle will fall And down will come, baby, cradle and all Well done! Thank you, Mr. Frog. Thank you for singing with me. Goodbye. Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. I'm crunching leaves, but only black leaves. <gasps> I see one. Let's look for more. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it. <laughs> Yay! See you. Which ant is black? There it is! Black ant. Which dog is black? There it is! Black dog. Which feather is black? There it is! Black feather. Which bowl is black? There it is! Black bowl. Very good! <laughs> peek a <-boo. laughs> Now, where did you go? Hmm. Oh! <laughs> I'm glad we saw each other today. See you! And now it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye, it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello again. We need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Hush a bye, baby, on the treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. When the bow breaks, the cradle.
trade away.